Morning. Thanks for joining us. A quiet neighborhood on Vancouver Island has become the scene of a shocking crime. Someone shot at a house belonging to a Punjabi music star and torched two vehicles. And as CTV's Brendan Strain reports, the apparent shooter captured the crime spree on camera. Early hours Monday morning. Multiple shots ring out on Ravenwood Road and Colwood. And it was coming from AP's house. AP Dylan, a rising star in the Punjabi music scene. Diane Reed lives nearby and ran to her kitchen window. And while I'm doing that, I see a vehicle leaving, but I couldn't describe the vehicle because there was so much smoke. Smoke from two vehicles set ablaze in the home's driveway. This video taken by the apparent shooter circulated heavily on social media. CTV News has not been able to authenticate this video, although it shows the same house that stands here at 3346 Ravenwood Road today, riddled with 14 bullet holes and showing the obvious aftermath from the vehicle fires in the driveway. I mean, it's surprising to me that the, these type of events are happening in, in this area. Bikram Singh used to live in the area. He came by today to see for himself. It's disappointing to see and shocking as well. The homeowner, A.P. Dillon, was not home at the time of the shooting, although Reed says one man living in the home was. Fortunately, he got out of the house and he was okay. Dillon released this statement on social media saying, I'm safe, my people are safe. Thank you to everyone who reached out. Your support means everything. Peace and love to all. In a statement, RCMP say a preliminary investigation suggests that this was a targeted event and that there is no further risk to the general public. CTV News reached out to the RCMP today for an interview, but was told they will not be taking questions. With many rumors circulating on social media that this was a crime that has ties to conflicts in India, thus leaving many in this neighborhood looking for answers to questions that are not being taken by the RCMP. You as the news media should be given more information so we all know what is going on. Why they are not telling us what exactly is happening. We live in the community. We have our right to know that what exactly is happening in our community. Brendan Strain, CTV News, Colwood.